here we are on the main straight, start finish, start the lap. Up the hill, it really goes up the hill, so it means you can break very, very late. Um, first key corner, probably one of the slowest corners. And yeah, now it's getting, going into the first sector. Really exciting because uh, very fast S's, that's all flat, full throttle up to six gear. Uh, just a little braking and then um, it's yeah like a never ending corner, left, right, left, right. Um, downforce is very important over here. And as you see, also quite a bit of elevation change. Um, it's quite technical too. So um, now we are the slowest part of the first sector. Um, second gear up to third, fourth gear, and now we come to the first hairpin, which is uh, probably one of the best overtaking places on the track. Um, yeah, down to first gear, as you see, prototype traffic um, is an issue here. Um, on that long straight, not so much, but in the SS it can be affecting your line quite a bit. Yeah, back on the main straight, on the back straight, um, top speed should be about 255k up to six gear. Uh, braking zone is very slippery here, it's going downhill, um, you go down to, uh, yeah, also first gear, uh, very slippery as I said, and now you, we arrive at the last sector, quite a technical section, a uh, lot of hairpins, a lot of first gear corners, this one is first gear, back to second, and yeah, down to first gear again, uh, you need a good combination of mechanical grip in the last sector, and good downforce in the first sector. That long right hander is four skiers and uh, quite interesting because it's very hard to the front left tire. It's a very long right hand corner, four skier, very quick. Um, this one, one gear down. You have to watch the track limits on the right hand side, easy to overshoot that corner. Down to first gear again for the last corner. Watch the exit curbs because they're quite high. And back to start finish. That was a lap with Stefan Mücke in the 4GT.